Jesus was asked by the chief priests and elders about his authority. He responded by asking them whether John's baptism was from heaven or of human origin. They could not answer without facing backlash from the people. Jesus then said he would not reveal his authority either. This is Leonard. Leonard is very rich and owns a vineyard. Leonard wants to go abroad for a while and rents his vineyard to Mike, Sam, and Jim. That means that Mike, Sam, and Jim can use Leonard's vineyard, harvest its crops, and sell them, and only have to pay a small amount of rent to Leonard. So, Leonard flies to another country and leaves his vineyard with the three men. After Mike, Sam, and Jim have taken care of the vineyard for a while, someone is sent by Leonard to come and pick up the rent. But Mike, Sam, and Jim do not want to pay the rent. Instead, they beat up the messenger and send him away. When Leonard hears this, he sends the messenger back. This time Mike, Sam, and Jim beat him up so badly that he dies. Then a second messenger is sent by Leonard to pick up the rent. This messenger is also beaten up and killed by Mike, Sam, and Jim. Leonard begins to think, what can I do with these people? Then he has an idea. I will send my own son to them. I'm sure they will listen to him. When Mike, Sam, and Jim see the arrival of Leonard's son, they get excited. This is the only son. If we kill him, the vineyard will be all ours. Not hesitating, they kill Leonard's son. Then Jesus asked his listeners, What do you think Leonard will do with Mike and Sam and Jim? For sure he will punish them and take away the vineyard from them and give it to someone else. Jesus told this story to point to his coming death and to show that through him everyone will be able to come to God not only the Jewish people. One day, some people came to Jesus because they wanted to trap him. They asked him, Teacher, tell us, is it right to pay taxes to the emperor? At that time, the Jewish people, including Jesus, were ruled by the Romans, who forced them to pay high taxes. Jesus was angry, you don't really want to know the answer. You just want me to say something that will make people angry because you want to get rid of me. Show me a coin. Whose image is on this coin? That of the emperor. Then give the emperor what belongs to him and give God what he asks of you. They had nothing to say and left. The Sadducees, who didn't believe in resurrection, asked Jesus about a woman who had married seven brothers. They wanted to know whose wife she would be in the resurrection. Jesus explained that in the resurrection, people do not marry and are like angels. He also cited Moses to show that the dead rise, as God is the God of the living. The teachers of the law agreed, and no one else questioned Jesus. Jesus questioned why the Messiah is called David's son when David himself referred to the Messiah as his Lord. He also warned his disciples about the teachers of the law who seek public respect, enjoy high status, and exploit widows while pretending to be pious. They will face severe punishment. <laughs>